Most kumas only consume porno and expand manfish. To be able to not only taste her fart, but also smell her fart and see how it would smell, what the aroma would be like, because obviously it would be different each time. But once in a blue moon, however, a man comes along that turns his sweet palm passion into a business venture, and today we will look at one such fellow, Rick Graves. Now, before I continue, I will say that Rick has the palsy, and he is just doing something that he enjoys, so please don't harass him. And this video is not meant to come across as mean-spirited. Who is Grimes? Rick Grimes is one of those poor souls that had his entire life ruined by a single decision. According to his own IMDB page, he has cerebral palsy due to the interns assisting his 13-year-old mother in giving birth using forceps instead of using a C-section, which caused some brain damage. Despite that, he has kept busy over the years doing movie reviews, creating wallpapers, and apparently made the logo for some band called Broke Down Cadillac. He also ran a wrestling fan website, wrestling being the media that apparently ties all autists together. Eventually, he got into reviewing adult films. In modern times, he advertises this on his two Twitter accounts, and writes about it on his blogger page called Black Halo Adult Reviews. And yes, this is a webpage dedicated to text reviews of adult films, and incredibly detailed reviews at that. You might be asking, how do you write a detailed smut review? And Black Halo is here as our guide to show us how. Now let me just say that because this video is going up on the YouTubes, the land of mass censorship by the global elite, I'm going to have to censor quite a lot of this and use some euphemisms. So anyway, let's get reading. Reality Kings, whose hose is bigger. The scene opens up with Andrew Young's. Okay, I won't talk like that. Doing her best to attract attention to a car wash, shaking her thing, as she soon happens to attract the attention of one Damien Dansky. Angel would go on to explain that she, to wash his truck, it would be twenty dollars. It's something that Damien is ex definitely on board for. The scene would progress with a montage showing Angel get into work. We get to see Angel soap up every inch of Damien's truck as her voluptuous body is on nice display. He's getting into so what she's doing that before we know it, her very big and very nice ripe melons are out. <clears throat> well, okay. So we are getting an in-depth rundown on the opening scene here, so I guess our first lesson is that you should be analysing the story structure as if you're watching a Scorsese film. Anyway, it goes on for a while, so let's skip ahead. Angel's attention kind of wanders as she happens to grab something rather big underneath Damien's big black skinny jeans. Angel's rather mesmerized. This, and she must get a look. It would be this moment as she quickly unzipped Dansky and pulled it out at first sight. Angel finds herself quite impressed with Damien's large cooked cucumber, as she cannot wait to get a taste. And, ah! It leads to the two going from innocent afternoon car wash to full-blown bedroom tussles. That's the problem with adult films. You know, whatever the story is, it's just going to end up with leading to shagging. As you can see, Rick likes to give a play-by-play -play of events. I wonder if he learnt this technique from his wrestling site. Things rather ramp up later when uh, the film ramps up. The camera for several times would switch between a side view as well as one from the overhead. I really enjoy the look from the letter as we could watch Angel as she does the job. She has really beautiful eyes which are nicely visible from the view. We also get a better sense of just how good she is at sucking it. Don't do it. I'm a virgin. I really like a double-handed approach at it, especially during the moment in which he underhanded Damien's salted peanuts with one hand while sucking and stroking with the other. It was just so hot and well coordinated. Really paints a picture in your head, sadly, doesn't it? He has a lot of adult film reviews, and all of his reviews are very detailed and puts a lot of adventure novels to shame with the action play by play, I must say. If you ever thought porno was just a 1 minute 30 cheap schlocky affair, Black Halo reviews will prove you wrong. He even lists the types of grabbing moves you're in for. Let's read on and see what his final thoughts were. 
Overall, this is a really good scene. More so because of the sexual material as opposed to the storyline that it begins with. When it comes to the story, don't get me wrong, it was somewhat fun in nature. I really like the car wash thing involving Angel Youngs. Oh, man oh man, is your body banging and the montage of the showcases in the great weight. The acting isn't that great, I have to admit. I bet Damien Dansky would even agree that he is not the best actor by any means. Luckily, however, when it comes to bedroom tuzzles, Dansky's a whole different animal. Recommended. I hope you have all come away having learned something and full of creative juices. Big shout outs to the post about Rick by Custom Chili on the farms and to you all for making it this far. As for me, I'm off to have a cold shower and then I'm going to close the garage door and put a hose through the car window. From work and catches them. So he tries to play it off like nothing happened. I was having some trouble with the shifter here. It's jammed. And I, I couldn't get it into drive. <coughs> Do you want to bet he tried talking and all sorts of weird, perverted sex shit? Like, bend over and let me pee in your butt. What? It's perfectly normal. All the chicks do it. 